Sky 9 over a police pursuit. Now we're told the suspect is wanted for reckless driving. And we're just getting over it, trying to learn more details right now. But this is going down right now in the Compton area. You can see about 53 miles per hour through these residential areas. It looks like a red pickup truck there just going right through that intersection on Penrose Avenue in Compton. At some point, we did have seen uh, then veer off to the other side, but this vehicle going rather fast for a Sunday night when people are on the road, Ross, and mm -hmm. things can get dangerous. Yeah, and we still have no information how many people may be in this pickup, uh, whether it's possibly believed that they have weapons, but this is a high rate of speed. The pickup has been driving here. Uh, LAPD's chopper overhead, though, and has it in their sights. It looks like he's stopping right here, pulling into a driveway. Let's see, hitting oh, the fence. See if he gets out or she. That suspect yeah. getting out, putting its, their hands up. Oh, oh and there's someone a Someone else from the passenger mm -hmm. side also getting out. Looks like both have their hands up. They are cooperating and the units with are right officers on scene. here mm -hmm. uh, as they have crashed that truck into what looks like a fence. Yeah. Doesn't look like much damage, but this all happening in Compton. Let's see if they get on the ground here. No doubt police are asking them to get on the ground to make sure that they have no weapons in their pockets and can't make any sudden moves. This is at each East Hatchaway Street and South Vesta Avenue in Compton. This pursuit has been going on for about 15 minutes. Mm. Pretty high rates of speed going through this neighborhood before they just suddenly uh, crashed into that fence. Ross, it looks like uh, possibly a woman and a man. Mm -hmm. They both have their hands up. We were told at some point possibly DUI may be involved here, but we know for sure it was reckless driving that they were wanted for. They did not stop, kept going, and now they found themselves in this situation. You know, that came to a pretty speedy end. Mm -hmm. uh, as soon as they crashed in there, those LAPD units were right there behind them. Yeah. Uh, that may be why uh, they decided not to run for it, thankfully, and at least uh, it appears that they are following police direction at this point. Yeah, you can see that uh, it looked like the gentleman was going, bending over there, maybe getting down to the ground. A lot of times we do see that happen, but it looks at least like both of these people are following directions to put their hands up. So this now coming to an end in the Compton area. It's a breaking story. As soon as these two are brought into custody or there's any more information, we'll get it right out to you.